Hey, hooray, wowzers! Hello, everyone! Big Forehead here to talk to you about anti-vaxxers. Hey, whoa, hey, hey, hey! Did someone say anti-vaxxers? Hey, just be cool. Be cool, buddy, okay? God, just chill, okay? Whatever you say. I'm watching. Oh. Whew. Okay. In case you don't know, anti-vaxxers are people that think vaccines cause autism or that they can hurt you in some way, despite there being very, very, very little evidence of that and a lot, a lot, a lot of evidence um, disproving that. So, you know, I thought it would be a fun idea. Why don't we go undercover as an anti-vaxxer on Facebook? That sounds pretty cool. Okay, so the character that I'm going to be using, uh, it's going to be Jonah from Bot or Thought. You guys remember that? Hello, everyone! What is today? Uh, I was going to use Lindsay again, you know, from Facebook Moms, um, but Facebook disabled that account after I made all those posts. I think I got reported a lot. That sucks. R.I.P. Lindsay. Always in our hearts. So, uh, yeah, on Tinder, Jonah was supposed to be like, you know, the super hot stud guy. I used pictures of a supermodel for him, you know, but, uh, for our purposes for this time, we're gonna try to turn him into like an old man kind of character. Um, I don't have a picture for you this time, but, um, I'd like you to imagine Jonah as, as a cross between Robert De Niro, um, Trevor from GTA 5, and a glass of chunky old milk. Um, I feel like that that's more than enough. I feel like that tells you plenty. So, uh, let's get into it. So, you know, I was looking on Facebook trying to find one of these vaccine pages, and I finally found one. It was called Corrupt Vaccines. Um, it looks legit. I still, honestly, I don't know. Because some of the stuff they post is just so stupid. Look, it says comedian, truther, artist, mother, anti-vax, and vaccine abolitionists. And then they link their Etsy shop. Oh, wow. These are like anti-vax memes, like little keychain things, I guess? My response to bitter vaccine pushers, all these flavors and you choose to be salt. I'm gonna go get up to date on my vaccinations. Not. <laughs> oh man, I got you, right guys? Like this video, subscribe to this channel. We like to have fun here, guys. Just look at their main, their profile picture. Does vaccines pushers be like, fucking delete this shit. <laughs> Yeah, man, you know them. You know those vaccine pushers. Man, they suck. Am I right, you guys? Am I right? Ah. When the nurse reads your file and finds out you decline toxic vaccines. Hi. That's a good meme. You know what? That's not bad. I'll give you that. That is an okay meme. Ha <laughs> ha! Very true. When I took my youngest daughter grocery shopping with me, the cashier told me that she looked sick, noting her red, blotchy skin, runny nose, and inflamed eyes. I told her that she was a crazy libtard, and that my daughter just looks that way. That's who she is! God, people these days. Things I trust more than vaccines. A one night stand with Charlie Sheen. Tap water from Flint, Michigan. An email from a Nigerian prince. A daycare run by Casey Anthony. Gas station sushi. And cocktails with Bill Cosby. All of these things are like inherently bad, I guess. But why gas station sushi? What's so bad about gas station sushi? Great meme! I'd like to add some. Things I trust more than vaccines. My ex-wife. A fart. The greasy college kid and this weird blunt he wants me to smoke. A globe head, flat earth for life. The entire Bush administration. And a tow truck company. I know they switch out your car for a dummy when you come pick it up, and then they sell the parts on the black market. Stay woke, people. It's tough out there. Here's a good one. It's like a meme, I guess. This is sort of a weird one. I like how they put their watermark on it, too. That's cute. That's cute. You think someone's gonna steal this? <laughs> Good meme, friend. Folks who say vaccines work. They're a lying bee? A flying lion? What? What is this meme? What is this? I don't understand this, and I understand a lot of stupid memes. 
Hey, uh, I'm in editing right now, but I finally got the joke. It's they, they're be lion. They be lion. Like be lion. Uh, but I don't understand this one. What is this? This is my brother after receiving seven vaccinations within a five minute period. He was so nice and energetic. Now he is a walking fish. Still think your vaccines are safe? Hmm? I feel your pain, brain. My daughter, God bless her blotchy skin, was taken from me by CPS after a small run-in with a cashier at a grocery store. I'm sure by now she's been pumped full of vaccines by these deep state government hoagies who want her to have normal skin. Newsflash, my daughter isn't normal. None of us are normal. I'm praying for your brother. Thank you for telling us about your brother, Brian. I hope he's okay. I hope he's doing well. When the doc says it's okay to vaccinate someone with eczema? <laughs> Whoa. False? Oh, this is me, you guys. This meme is me. Man, I would love to like this post, to, to comment on it like saying, ha ha, and to share it with all my friends because we just love a good anti-vax meme. You know, you know what I mean? I love these memes. They, they just confirm my beliefs that I just want to die at 27 um, with uh, mm. polio. Pro-vaxxers be like, I did my research. Mm, yeah, these pro-vaxxers, they're, they're so dumb. These, these guys, they don't know what they're talking about. Freaking Homer Simpson, that is relatable, man. Caitlin said, for real. So I said, you said it, Caitlin. All these vaxxy boys think they're so smart with their high school degrees and family sitcoms, but we know the truth. We aren't taken in by something as basic as The Simpsons. You and I are of a different breed, Caitlin. Those whose IQ are in the hundreds, at least, our intellectual minds are only stimulated by cultural prodigies like Alex Jones, Tim Allen, and of course, Rick and Morty. Doctors be like, ready for a government recommended toxic overload? Am I right, guys? Man, they're basically like Freddy Krueger. Man, uh, screw those doctors. What, they want to help me? In my America? Ugh. Nasty. Nasty. I'm so glad someone thought of this when they saw Freddy Krueger. <laughs> That's great. Thank you. Very true. I remember being a young lad and my mother bringing me to one of these doctors. He looked just like this. I begged and pleaded my mom to not let him touch me, but she didn't listen. And thus, I was poisoned by these wretched vaccines. That's right. Jonah has a tragic past, you guys, you know. He has his, his daughter with this measles disease that the doctors like to make up. Her, her red blotchy skin is supposed to be that way. Aren't we all accepting now? It's 2018. People can have red blotchy skin, okay? Slavery abolitionists. They never fought for safe plantations because there was no such thing. Vaccine abolitionists. They never fought for safe vaccinations because there is no such thing. Corrupt vaccines. Wow. That is, that is quite a stretch, man. That is, ooh, boy, Ugh, yikes. I don't have anything for that slavery meme. That's just, I, I don't know. I, you can't, that, I can't beat that. I can't beat that, you know? When someone includes me in a conversation and expects me not to bring up how toxic vaccines are, mm, um, yeah, 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 I'm gonna shove it in your face what I think. You know these vaccines, um, they're bad and you're bad too. Thank you, good night. OMG guys, this is literally me, like you do not understand. <laughs> oh, oh, I actually got into a fist fight with my Globehead Provax uncle because I wanted to educate him on vaccines. I mean, if he wasn't a bodybuilder, I could have taken him. I also started a GoFundMe for my boo-boos. Please help, thank you. Bullsh- <laughs> Vaccinations. That I love. That I absolutely love. No vaccinations. You know what? That's not a bad meme format. You know, that that could be very versatile. Let me try it right now. Uh, bullsh- <laughs> This is bullsh- <laughs> Now this. This I absolutely love. Who is this little elf? What Christmas movie is he from? Do they actually protest vaccines in this movie? 
Please tell me, I want to watch it. When someone says vaccines prevent diseases versus causing them. Oh, oh. Look, I, I love this little conversation here because I, I think this is a real page. Because you know, they're talking and they say, literally, I'm not even about to read the negative comments that will be on this. We're the first comments, LMAO. And then corrupt vaccines replied and they said, we block and delete those folks. Put your feet up at this page. So I guess this is real. I think this is a real page. I understand what you mean, but us anti-vaxxers shouldn't faint around pro-vaxxers because they might try to vaccinate us right there on the spot. You never know where a vax might come from, so you should always keep your eyes open near pro-vaxxers. It's simple. Just don't blink. Be vigilant, my brothers. When you're both pro-vaccine. <laughs> Oh, this is good. Uh, they're, they're just dummies. You, you guys, am I right? Maybe I should be a pro-vaxxer. I mean, look, they have beautiful skin. They get like these cool tattoos on their heads. Is that their car? That looks pretty sweet. But I mean, if they vaccinate, nah, nah. They'll be dead in a year from vaccinations. So this is very funny, haha. -ha. But I can't help but be reminded of my pro-vax wife, you know? She looked just like this dummy. I still miss her tons, but I could never be with a pro-vaxxer like her. Any other anti-vax warriors out here spending the summer alone? Oh. Okay, we gotta kick it into high gear, guys. My phone is gonna die before I can finish recording. Okay, so to top off this video, I thought I would make an anti-vaxxer meme for them to use on the Facebook page, okay? So I made the, ah, I made this one. Um, it's the, you know, you know the Yu-Gi-Oh meme format, like here's the global warming one. I think that's pretty funny. So I just put it into GIMP for like 30 seconds and I made, boom, this anti-vaxxer meme. Um, and I sent it to them on Facebook. I messaged it. You know, I, I sent it to the page. Hi, I have a meme you can use if you want, IDK. Um, and they just, you know, it's just like a pop-up message like, Thank you for messaging us, blah, blah, blah. Um, it's been about a day and they haven't replied to me, so that sucks. Uh, hopefully I can update. Hi, back to editing me. Um, they still haven't replied, man. It's been like six freaking days, seven I think, and nothing, literally nothing. Uh, you know, rejection hurts, you guys. Rejection hurts, but I think I'll be okay. But anyways, I said thank you for figting the good fight. You know what? That's a happy ending. You know, guys, you, we, we, whether you're pro-vax or anti-vax, we're all people, you know? It's just, um, anti-vaxxers are gonna die sooner. We'll see you next time.